Right, so we're going to look at the inside heel hook a while back in the UFC by Joe Soto and Marco Beltran. Um, Soto was able to hit it off of a um, head outside single. He dumps him to the mat, and then as Beltran is trying to circle around, right, to um, potentially take the back, he leaves his knee exposed and gets heel hook. And then he picks up the head outside single. He dumps him down, right? Beltran starts to scoot out, right? And so Soto has to stay low on the leg to prevent the back tape, right? The counter back tape, okay? As Beltran comes across and grabs the far hip, right? Beltran, um, or sorry, Soto is able to reach through and collect, okay? As he shoots his head through, he rolls, and he ends up with the target leg on top, right? Which is pretty fortuitous, right? He grabs the head, he grabs the arm, etc. These, of course, are insufficient using his hips, his knees, his back, et cetera. He's also fighting, right, by extending his leg and booting, but this actually is exposing the heel. A better choice would have been if he had rotated his knee, pointed his toes, and then looked to slip this way, okay? But he didn't. He's booting, right? He's able to dig, right? His legs are already triangled. And from here, right, it's gonna be tough to get out, all right?